Okay, perfect. So we're now in the ad set level. There's two forms of split testing. There's really, there's really three forms. There's really three forms of split testing and I'll explain all three. Um, split testing number one, scroll down. Let's go down, let's go down a little lower, little lower. Now, in your case, when you run local ads, especially for, for real estate, you wanna, you wanna go, down, go down further, 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 further. Okay, so you got location and then you got detailed targeting. So let's start with, let's start with, let's start with, with location. Edit the United States. So go ahead and edit, click on edit, take out United States. And then type in type in Carson. So go go ahead and and, and you're gonna always go people living in hit the drop down people living in this location people living in this location very very important. So so go ahead and search locations type in Carson. Okay, so you're going Carson. You're gonna always look for the drop down, and if you have to go all the way to to comma slash our comma and then California. There we go. Perfect. So right there. Okay. So here's split testing. So let's, let's scroll down. Let me there. move. Um, hold on a second. All right. Okay. So right here, right here, right here. Stop right here. Okay. So one form of split testing is let's say, as you mentioned before, there, in the very beginning, we were talking about what, four, three, four, five different cities you wanted to target, right? right. So what most try to do is they'll put off, let's call it five. They'll put all five in that field. So we'll go Carson. We'll go freaking um, shit. What other San Bernardino? We'll go freaking Long Beach, Irvine. What most people do is they'll try to put all five right there. And when you go and run that ad, you don't know which city is really bringing you the lead because you got all five listed. Right. So it doesn't tell you which one. It's just telling you that leads are coming in from all five. That's what you put in. So what you want to do, a form of split testing, this is split testing number one, is you want to separate all of them. So so it's not it's not it's not a starting up a whole new ad. It's just simply creating a second ad set. So okay. so so split testing number one is multiple ad sets. So what we would do is we would put Carson right there. And then we would we would we would X out. So go ahead and X out. Go ahead and hit the X to the top left. So there's Carson. Let's X out to the top right there. Let's X that out. So go ahead and go ahead and close. Okay. So now this right here is Carson. So refresh this page. We're in the middle. We're in the middle tab. This is the ad set. Go ahead and refresh this right page. Here. Yep. You, actually, no, no. At the top, just refresh it. The top. Just hit your refresh the little um, circle at the top, the very, very top left, very, very top right there. Yeah, right there. Perfect. So refresh this. Actually, we didn't name it. We, we need to name it also. It's going to still say new ad set. Let's name it. You always want to name it. So um, let's go back in real quick. Right when it po pop populates, where's the... Um, Okay, let's edit this. And at the very, very top, that's why the titles are so important. Very, yeah. very important. So at the very, very top, it says new ad set. Name that Carson. Yeah. So this is one way to split test is we're now going to split test the cities. So, okay, so now X out, top left, X out. So when you when you put in information to the fields, you don't have to save it. Uh, no, no, it saves. So go ahead and X out. Okay, so now go ahead and close. So click out, let's click away from that. Click, click, click right there, just click. Okay, so there's Carson, okay, there's Carson. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna simply go back and I'm gonna, I'm gonna I, I can hit duplicate. So right here, I can click on duplicate, go ahead and duplicate it. Mm -hmm. Now I'm gonna come back in and I'm gonna hit duplicate, the blue one. And now on this second one, I'm going to put in the second city. So the very, very top, Carson copy, delete that. We got to be very specific with these titles. So now we're going to put in the second city. So I just put Compton. Compton. Perfect. Now scroll down, go down to the map and, and change out. You're going to X out Carson and you're going to simply put in Compton. Let's X out Carson. And now we're going to type in Compton.
Okay, perfect. Hit the drop down. And now let's X out. So top left, X out. And we'll do one more because I'm pretty sure you're getting the hang of this. Close. And then we'll do it again. So just hover over it and click on duplicate. Now we'll do, we'll do a cover city. Go ahead and duplicate. Go ahead and, and, and delete the title, put in Culver City, and then come down and find that on the map. This is one form of split testing. When you're split testing the cities to see which city is the one that pops. So what you would do <sighs> is you would end up running this and you'll run it for three days. Three days yeah. by the uh, third. The, the question is, is, but as far as billing, how, how would that? Because yeah. if you're so running each if you're, one, yeah. So go ahead and scroll down. Based on this daily budget, you're at 20 bucks a day. You'd be at 60 bucks a day. But okay. here's the. Wait, I'd have to reduce that to maybe maybe uh, 30. Like oh, 10. for sure, whatever. That that that's besides the point. Whatever you could do that, whatever you want. So, but here's the here's the thing. It's not like you're running it for a month. You're not even running it for the full campaign if, you're, if your campaign is seven days or 10 days or 14 days, whatever. It's only three days. So you okay. run this. In three days, you'll see which city is popping. So right. out of and, – and what you'll do in this case is you always want to do four to five. So in three days, you're going to have one out of five, maybe two out of five that are actually popping. And then in, in, on that third day, you want three complete days. So on that, on, on that, on that third evening, the third, third day or whatever, the nighttime, whatever, mm. you'll come in and you'll shut off the other ads. You'll shut off the other four or the other three that are not performing as well. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. So that's one form of split testing. Another form of split testing is when you're doing this, Let's say we go with one city. We go with one city. Mm -hmm. But now our split testing is based on the interest, is based on the detailed targeting. Go ahead. Well, I was going to ask you a question. Uh, I already selected it. Huh? I, I thought I didn't, but you see Yeah, it's right at the top. You're good. You're good. Okay. So you're trying to do another one. So, so X out. And now you'll see it over here. So you'll hit close. And now there goes your three, your three different cities. Now, again, this is one form of split testing. The other form of split testing is when you're split testing keywords. So let's say, okay. let's say it's only Carson. We're only going to focus on Carson. But okay. in, the, in the detailed targeting where you can actually put the demographics of what people are interested in, Zillow, Realtor.com, homeowners, like the keywords. The second form of split testing is when you're, is when you're doing that. So you're, okay. you're, you're choosing one keyword at a time. So I'm going to, so rather than having five cities, I'm going to have five different keywords. Okay. Okay. I might put Zillow. Second one, Realtor.com. Third one, Redfin. Right? So yeah, Redfin is very popular these days. Maybe, oh yeah. So. Yeah, for sure. And then, and then um, that's when you're split testing based off of interest, based off the keywords of interest, right? The third form of split testing is when you're going with where you're is when you're going with one city, um, and 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 even in your case, I don't even I don't even recommend doing the second form of split testing, which is the interest, the keywords, Realtor.com, Redfin. You don't need you don't need any of that. If anything, in your case, you're going to split test with cities. Okay? okay. So let's just focus on that. You're going to split test this way, or the second way is you would you would go with just Car Carson. Let's say let's say now we're going to go do a different split test ad, a completely different ad, and we're going to split test that one. And in that one, we're going to go just Carson, but we're going to now split test the image. So, so in this case, we're going to do we're going to do three cities, and we're running it to one image. That's and what we're you, doing here. And but then the, you kind of measure the results to see which one have more and more action, correct? Based off of this, yes, yes, yeah. in okay. three days. But what I'm what I'm now explaining is the other way to split test. The other way to split test is we go with one city. And then we split test five different images. So okay. now click on the click on the third tab to the right, ads for one ad set, the third tab. So let's say this is just Carson. Let's say that's one ad set. We got just Carson. Now over here, we're going to simply go with, we're going to duplicate, duplicate, duplicate. We're going to put one image and then we're going to duplicate. And then we're going to go back into it, put a different image. Close it okay. out. 
close it out, go back, third tab, we're in the third tab, duplicate. And then now I'm gonna go add, all I'm changing out is the other image. Okay. So maybe all these damn images that you, that you showed me earlier, those are all perfect for split testing. So you don't mm -hmm. gotta think about, okay, shit, which one do I rock with? Put them all in there. And then let's just see which one pops in three days. Yeah. So, Yo, so I just wanted to uh, kind of get a preview of what's, what's coming up yeah. next. Oh, yeah, for sure. Um, so, so split testing ad sets is one thing. And then over here is what you call split testing your ad creatives. I see. Okay, so Very you're good. either split testing your ad sets and you're creating multiple ad sets or you're creating multiple ad creatives. That's the image or the video, but really it's, it's with image. Okay. Because I could put multiple images. I can't put, I don't, I don't need to put multiple videos and see which video pops. That's just too much. Let me just yeah. split test my images and see which image is the one that's going to pop. And you'll have that data in three days. Three days is good enough to, to really look at it and say, okay, damn, this fourth image is the one that's winning. Let's shut off the other three. Or this wow. one city Carson's hidden. Let's shut off Compton, shut off the other ones. Cause it's, it's only cars. It's only this other city that's popping. Shut off the other ones. Okay. So it's not like you got to rock with, you know, a high budget the entire time. It's only for the first <clears throat> three days for the Very testing, good. for the testing, you know? So multiple ad sets is what you'll want to do for sure. Multiple ad creatives, if you're going image, is what you want to do for sure. Um, three days, and then, and then you find your winner. Okay. You know? So that's how you do it, bro. Yeah. 